Welcome to the vlog! Welcome to the vlog! Welcome to the motherfucking vlog! Welcome to the 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 vlog! Season 3! Welcome to the vlog! Hello, Monday honestly wasn't the best day. I got up, did my workout, that was fine, but I worked, had lunch, got groceries, wasn't feeling that great, but pizza in the evening was super yummy as usual. But yeah, not the best day. Hello, I am attempting to style this for the first time. I think I'm the most nervous about having actual bangs, so I'm gonna try and do that. I'm gonna try to do this with composure. We'll see how it goes. That was so easy. I think it looks fine. I'm leaving it like this because I don't really care that much about how it turns out, but. It was Alyssa's birthday and she very kindly invited me to do Pilates with her and Miranda. It was so much fun. And then I got to My work. brain is not working, obviously. I feel like I've been operating like at 50% for the past week and a half. I forgot my key card at home. I'm frustrated. Luckily, my coworker Mocha is coming in today, so I'm just waiting for him. It's not a big deal. Like, it's really not a big deal. I'm just like frustrated with myself because I feel like I'm usually pretty on top of like stuff. I had a very productive day before I knew it. It was over and I was going home. I was meeting up with Allie and Emma for dinner. We went to the Flying Pig in Yale Town. We all got very yummy drinks, very yummy food. The desserts were great. It was just a good way to, to end spring. Guys, it's literally 9.15 and it's still this light out. It's actually, okay, every year I'm like, it's crazy. It happens every year, but it's still really nice. I might sit at the beach for a bit, just like soak in the summer evening. I guess it's still spring, but tomorrow it's summer. I chilled out on the beach for a while before finally going home. Hello, new day today. I am gonna do a tempo-ish run. Um, I'm only gonna be out for like 40 minutes. It's not meant to be a long run. I'm just trying to improve my speed, so. The speed work was super fun. I got out around 6.6 .6 kilometers and then I did my workout with George. We had a quick coffee together and then I got my ass to work. Again, it was a very long day. I was kind of tired and then I walked over to Trout Lake to meet up with Turner. My feet were also killing me by the end of this walk, but it was good. I got to the park. Turner and I talked for a bit and then we went to a sushi place in East Van and then he drove me home. Thursday, I started by going on a run. I did around 8.8 .8 kilometers. It was super fun and it was just meant to be a little bit easy. Very good. I'm just trying to get an easy run in today. So it's going well. I'm at like 5k. I have like probably three and a half to get home. So pretty good. I was not feeling like riding. So Turner drove me into the office, which was very nice of him. And yeah, the day was long. Literally every day at work these past three days, so busy so many meetings love it but also i leave work every day feeling a little bit tr like drained i was so productive this week though i'm so happy it was such a beautiful day so obviously i had to walk home i enjoyed that very much and then went to my grandparents for supper as usual everything was very very yummy and it was just a nice and relaxing evening and then i started watching jury duty which is so funny friday i woke up and went on a seven kilometer walk this was really fun and look at these geese i thought they were looking really cute in the grass then i did my little workout and the day was actually so busy after the coffee i wasn't able to take a break until like 2 30 which is weird for a friday but once i did i got some errands done and then hello so as soon as work ended i actually <laughs> fell asleep for 90 minutes i don't usually nap like that and i have to get out of the house to go to dinner in like 15 minutes i am glad i didn't like sleep through <laughs> anything actually important i do need to throw myself together a little bit for the night okay this is the fit for tonight I was able to get ready. My allergies are actually kind of bothering me, so I'm gonna take a uh, reaction, but hoping that tonight is fun. Met up with Nathan, Kieran, and Tay. We went to Gyukaku. It was so much fun, some barbecue, loved it. And then I walked home with Kieran, and then the next day I was out on another run. Hello, we got a good 10K done. Honestly, I was not feeling it. Around 3K, I wanted to quit considering it, but I was like, no, just get to 10 and you could call it a day. But it's done, and now I get to get home 
and shower and just be clean for the rest of the day. Got home and edited and then I walked to my grandparents, saw this adorable cat, and then we had some pizza together. I also watched this show that has Camp Sassmat in it, which was cool. Then I did a very long walk with Silk. It ended up being like 13 kilometers. We saw a corgi, we got some coffee. It was just a very good afternoon. Ooh. Then I visited Kiara's house. She's fostering some kitties. Oh my god. Of course the kittens were cute, but I was so, so obsessed with the mother. She was just such a little angel and so affectionate. Like, she just loved putting her paw out. <laughs> She's so precious. She's so precious, this mother cat. and her parents were throwing a party, but I couldn't stay for long, but it was nice to see everyone while I was there. And then I bust out to Port Moody, saw a corgi, and Turner was hosting a little wine night, and Georgia was here, and somebody made a guest appearance. No fucking way, are you serious? <laughs> Who has FOMO now? <laughs> <laughs> Troy made a surprise visit back from Edmonton. We were all very surprised and happy to see him. It was a really fun night with everybody. Sunday was great because I got to sleep in a ton. Turner watered the flowers and then we went out to brunch together. We went on a five kilometer walk as well. That was really great. It was just such a warm day and then afterwards we watched jury duty for a little bit and then Turner drove me back to the SkyTrain station and I bust out to meet up with George. We were having a little picnic with Kakai, Richard, Abid, and Vincent. It was really fun. It was just a nice way to spend a summer afternoon. I also played a lot of spike ball. Then I got home and edited. Hello, I have just finished editing everything, so I'm just like saying my little goodbyes to y'all. This week went a lot better than last week. I'm feeling really good. This is the last vlog actually before I turn 25. Next week's gonna be a longer one. Be prepared, there will not be an episode dropping on Sunday. The episode will drop next Wednesday on the 5th because it's the special season finale. So when you don't see the episode on Sunday, that's why, next week. Uh, I'm so excited. There's lots going on next week. Oh, but fuck, I'm tired. This is a long day. I was out in the sun for a lot of it too. I am looking forward to next week. Uh, to be honest, I am not looking forward to working tomorrow just cause things have been pretty busy at work lately. So it's not as chill as it was maybe in like previous weeks. So nothing bad. My Sunday scaries are pretty minimal. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Things are going good. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week.